Researchers at Duke University have developed a potential game changer for the millions of people suffering from knee problems. They're creating a synthetic cartilage that brings immediate pain relief and can serve as a much needed alternative to knee replacement. Bill O'Neill went to Durham for this one. The researcher behind this breakthrough says it will benefit everyone from weekend warriors to professional athletes. The options for those who suffer with knee pain are slim. Many start out taking Advil, then move on to a cortisone shot and finally a full knee replacement. Some just suffer with the pain. That may change. If you have a damaged area in your knee, uh, the surgeon can simply go in and replace that area with this synthetic cartilage and you can just go on with your life immediately thereafter. No more waiting months for your cartilage to heal, according to Duke professor Ben Wiley, who says the new synthetic cartilage called hydrogel is actually stronger than your own cartilage. Anyone can use this. You know, the largest football player, you can go back onto the field with confidence. His, health, his normal cartilage is going to fail before this does. <laughs> the implant called ORMI, which is Greek for motion or to move, includes hydrogel, which is made of water, cellulose, and polyvinyl alcohol, a material used in contact lenses. So we see there's the hydrogel on the top surface. Do we feel it? Yep. First, we'll move them. And on the backing is, of course, titanium. So this is the place where your bone can grow in and permanently attach it. The synthetic cartilage has already been tested in sheep and currently has 2,000 people signed up for a clinical trial. How I think about it is, you know, with a, with a cavity in your tooth, you don't wait for the tooth to leak for power. All right, you just go in, replace it, and get on with your everyday life. Clinical research is scheduled to begin later this year, and this new and improved cartilage could be on the market in the next three to four years. In Durham, on the campus of Duke, I'm Bill O'Neill, WXII 12 News.